think this is a keeper, though. <laughs> <laughs> All right, folks. This is News Flash. What is today? Monday? Uh, news. Monday this is News Flash Monday. News Flash Monday. Beep, boo, beep, boo. Alert. Pierre has on a monster, monster redfish on a float rig. Let's see that rod bending. All right. We don't know if we're even going to see this sound again. We don't even know if we're going to see it because this rod was sitting in the rod holder when I was on the phone with a guy from the Canadian border up in upstate New York. Pierre had to jump on this. Damn, that's a hard pull. Yeah, he because you know why? Getting... All that current. You're in so much current. He is not getting... Look at the current, folks. Can you see the current? Look at the leads going by. Big, big current. He's getting tired. All right. I'll be back to you if we get this to the boat. Monday update. We're still on this red. It has to be at least 10 minutes later. I have been on the phone with past customer that I had two days ago. Talked to him and Pierre is sitting here pumping this dude back in heinous current and deep water. So again, I'll let you know, look at the rod bending. And that is a fairy wand of a fairy wand yeah, that, that rod's a snowflake. <laughs> you need to tell him? No, I ain't going there. <laughs> Look at this, folks. He's going underneath the boat in Try front of the boat. No, go around. Turn. Make sure you get him turning. Get him turning. There comes the float, folks. Oh, my God. Look at this dude. Look at this dude. Holy Look at this dude. Shit. Look at this dude. I ain't seen him yet. No, you won't see him. Don't worry about seeing him. Just keep him... Oh God, it's a big bull red. I was just telling Pierre that we've had 26 pounders caught here before. Let's see how big this one is. If we get them. In February. In February. That's the key. I don't know why. We almost were doing net cam, folks. We're almost doing net cam. And that redfish can do anything he wants to do. Yeah. Don't have enough with that rod. All right, folks, I'll get back with you again. We saw him. At least we know how big he is. Huge. <laughs> Look at that, folks. Still yeah. taking line after yeah. all this time. Do you know why? I could stand in a parking lot and you could be 50 feet away and I could hold that hook. And as hard as you can pull with that rod, I could hold that hook with two fingers yeah. because there's no there's no ass in those rods, yeah. and that's that's the reason why a bull redfish or any redfish clobbers you on those rods. But it's perfect for a trout. Yeah, you know. But they're fun. Yeah. The redfish on these rods. Oh yeah, it don't get no funner. <laughs> it's the funnest. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we're gonna maybe see him again, folks. Gonna go ahead and reel right on down again. So all you gotta do is you just gotta get inches, man. Inches. Okay, go ahead, reel all the way to the water. All the way to the water. Not that bad boy? <laughs> Woo -hoo! Look at that. There monster. we go, folks. Ah, damn. Look at that monster. Alright, so, give, give yourself some line, stick it right in the rod holder. All right, folks. I think we might be getting close to ex the same as we had before. Ooh, that's a big fish. That is one big dog. Whoa. <laughs> that big is a big dog. Now, official weight. How much? Okay, official weight. Well, I can put them on a 60. 
Okay, we just beat the record. The largest redfish float rig fishing ever. There's a 30 pounder, 30 pounder. Woo! The biggest ever has always been 26 pounds. All Monster. Right. We got some blood here. The hook was right in his gill. So there he is. Unbelievable, 30 pounder. Biggest redfish ever on a float rig, period. Beat the, the old record was 26 at this exact same spot. If you wanna know the spot, you gotta come and fish with Dave. There you go. Speaking the truth. <laughs> Speaking the truth. Speaking the truth. <laughs> We're a bunch of truth tellers on this boat. Unfreaking believable. Unbelievable. We're sitting here and we caught nothing but a yellow mouth trout. And then all of a sudden this dude. Well, we just gotta get just hold him down in there. Ass out. All right, stick a fork in our ass. We're done. Yeah.